I turned up in the Big Apple with nobody I knew here, not knowing where to live, not knowing how to get around, and uh, a very challenging job. John Ritter has made a life out of making the best of his situations and bettering the circumstances of others. He graduated from the University of Denver in 1972 with a degree in civil engineering and physics. After working in Denver for an engineering company, he accepted a job in New York to design and build power plants. Part of the reason I decided to be involved with the Alumni Association was because I had such a difficult, difficult transition finding where to live, creating a new circle of friends. And I have almost nobody, maybe two or three people I knew from DU with whom I had a relationship that I could develop friends with. So uh, I wanted to create an alumni association here in New York where people could congregate, come together, meet their friends, at least have somebody that they could be familiar with, that they could rely upon for good advice. And he has. Ritter has been involved in the Alumni Association for more than three decades and has served as president of the New York Alumni Board for 10 years. His vision was to concentrate on memorable and meaningful events, making sure new DU graduates could find support. His board has hosted current students with programs like the Walk on Wall Street and the Corbell Trip to the United Nations. They've held fun events at the Westminster Dog Show, the Historical Society, and local bars and restaurants. In fact, it's a trademark of Ritter's to pick a new restaurant for each board meeting, this one taking place at Pershing Square. Members of the board describe him as amazingly hospitable. And he's just very inviting. At the beginning of every event, he makes sure he introduces himself to anyone new that's coming in, making them feel very welcome, and then tries to introduce them to other alumni that are already there in their industry. He also often opens his own home, and we understand his wife is an amazing cook. I appreciate very much the support that my wife has given me over the years. You know, she allows me, uh, she doesn't get too upset with me when I run off to Denver for uh, a week of meetings with the alumni uh, office, or, and she, she uh, is a great supporter of, of all the alumni events we have. And when I uh, invite the board members over to my house, she loves to make pasta carbonara. Ritter walked away from engineering three years after being in New York and has become a successful broker and real estate developer. He's now a partner at Shalom and Zuckerbrot. What I also noticed here in New York is that the big Eastern schools have the alumni connection that provides huge job opportunities. And so I said to myself, if we can create a core group of people with whom the recent grads can connect. They can tie into a, an alumni base that will give them access to the major corporations and job opportunities. When we provide that to DU grads, they are going to say, this university has created the basis for my success. For his dedication to the students and alumni of the University of Denver, the Alumni Association is honored to present John Ritter with the Randolph P. McDonough Award for Service to Alumni. <laughs>